Hi everyone, my name is Dr. Veera Gupta, and this week in my office, I've seen a lot of one condition. I'm not going to tell you what it is yet, and tell me if you have any of these symptoms. A headache, just feel tired, feel foggy, don't feel right, um, have confusion. These are all symptoms of people who are dehydrated. I had a patient come in earlier this week who was like a gray green color. She tried to go for a run and when by the time she got into my office, she could barely stand. The first thing I did was take her blood pressure. If you're worried about being dehydrated, grab a cuff, put it on your arm. 120 over 80 is considered a pretty standard blood pressure for your average adult, okay? 110 over 70 is also fine. But when you start getting the low numbers, this lady was at like 100 over 60, that's low blood pressure, okay? So what do you do about that? The first thing you do is you pump someone full of electrolytes. Electrolytes are sodium, potassium, magnesium, and chloride, okay? You can do Himalayan sea salt, essential water, tailwind is an excellent electrolyte, noon tablets, emergency. You have five very easy viable options that you can get at any Costco, any ShopRite, okay? And what you do is you put those in your water, down it, take your blood pressure again. It should go up if it is in fact a dehydration related issue because the electrolytes are what hold the water into your system. You can drink all the water you want, but it's gonna go right through you if you don't have enough electrolytes. Now here's another one. Have you ever like licked your lips after you've been outside and they taste salty? Those are your electrolytes. They have left the system, which means you need to replenish them. After 30 minutes of continu contiguous exercise, you lose electrolytes. So it's very important to replenish them, especially if you're a swimmer, because you don't know how much you lost you've been in the water. So if any of those are your symptoms and you need to get your blood pressure up, electrolytes are the way to go. And you just keep drinking them and keep taking your blood pressure until it goes up. It's very important to have water with electrolytes because the water by itself will not help you. So first thing you do, grab a blood pressure cuff. If your blood pressure is low, that's what I suggest you do. If your blood pressure is high, stay tuned for the next video.